have you found the most interesting for you in this uh, project and Julian the Phantoms? Uh, so many, so many things. I mean, it's my first experience with Netflix and that has been really enjoyable. Finding the cast was just an incredible uh, journey and experience. My writers and, and producing partners, uh, Dave Hoge and, and, and Dan Cross, and just how it's reaching people and the feedback that we're getting from the press. And it's just all been just a, a really wonderfully positive experience. You work with young people, uh, and I, I know that you work with very experienced uh, singers like Madonna or Elton John, but what do you find the most exciting to work with these newcomers in the business? Their bravery and, and, and their uh, thirst for growth and experience. Uh, their generosity and excitement and, and, and passion that they bring to each day. Uh, they're, they're so full of life and, and, and kindness and good spirit. Well, what was the biggest challenge for you during the show? The biggest challenge, I think, is just, uh, I mean, there's a lot of hours. I mean, it's, there's, like, there's so much time that we have to spend in prep which we need because when you're doing these big music sequences and everyone's actually singing, everyone's actually playing their instruments, like you want to just prep, prep, prep for it. And then the hardest thing is just, you're doing like a, a music performance, like Now or Never or Bright or Stand Tall, any of them, you're trying to give a hundred percent energy throughout the whole day. And you can be doing the same song um, full out for probably like 12 hours straight. You know, like, I mean, it's the equivalent of if you're a, a band and you go on tour, and you had a set that was like 12 hours long. I mean, it's like, that's brutal. Uh, and so I think trying to keep the energy up throughout the day and make sure that every take you're really still giving it and you're not just kind of uh, being like, ah, all right, I'll give like half on this one, I'm, I'm tired. And I think just sticking with it, staying committed to giving full energy the whole time uh, is, is the challenge, but it's also the reward at the end of it because it, it looks so good once it's done. Uh, so the hardest thing for me was uh, learning how to balance 16 hours on set and also doing laundry. You know, it's kind of crazy. Like, I don't really think there was like a challenge. I mean, like I was so Julie and everything we kind of like already knew about. We just had to kind of like, you know, hone our skills on more. Like we just had to get better at it, um, especially when it came to like the music parts and just our instruments. Like, we knew pretty much how to do everything that we did in the show. Um, it was just more about pushing ourselves and challenging ourselves to do better and kind of just like leap over like what our standards were and just kind of like set the bar a little higher, higher than already was. Do you like musicals? Yes, the answer is definitely yes. And I got a list of them. Like we have like the musical drawer at our house where it's just the musicals. And like, I could quote you, um, I could quote you High School Musical, Grease, Hairspray, Mamma Mia though. Oof. When yeah. Meryl Streep is singing and then they're walking up to the wedding there and she's singing to Pierce Brosnan at that then she's just like, I gotta go. And her hair is flying behind her and she's just like, Oh, or the one when, oh, when her and um, the, the girl there, she's also in Ted, uh, when they're singing and it's like the mom and they're like getting ready for the wedding, it just brings to me. Why have you been keeping those cute boys a secret? They're ghosts. When we play together, people can see them. She drops in unannounced to upstage me with her little hologram act? <laughs> what was that? Describe your show in one word. I want to say hold on, but you, it, it, that's two. Um, uh, I'm going to do it in like a, it's more of like a, what? That's kind of, <laughs> I'm going to say, what? Or, or adventure. Adventure. Okay. Uh, I would say bonkers, just bonkers. Do I ever get to meet these guys?